Daivaden. I'm a Gugutha Gundich Mara man. And I'm a songman storyteller. I started right here. You know, um, grew up in Abbotsford, Collingwood. My music started there and then come up to Fitzroy. That's where all the mob congregated to um, get out of the clutches of the mission, mission mentality, the government, simulation policies and, you know, stolen generation policies. Our great grandfather, can we Ebenezer Lovett, he come down here, you know, to, you know, fight for existence for Aboriginal people. You know, just to be like any other man. Uh, I'm a living descendant of that. You know? That had the, you know, the beautiful thing to grow up in Collingwood Fitzroy. Yeah. I remember the old people and the old aunties and the old grandmothers would always make sure you had a feed. Food in your belly before anything happens, you know? And that way you, you keep some sort of you know, sustainability towards being healthy. Damp is a big one that goes with everything. The old Johnny cake was a, you know, was a form of the, of the damper. Uh, one you baked in the oven, the other, or in, you know, in the fire, and the other one was you, you fried in the, you know, fry pan. Uh, you have it for breakfast, <laughs> you have it for lunch and, and dinner, you know. My name's Greg Hampton, I'm the head chef at Charcoal Lane. Uh, this is Catherine and Cody. So what I've got here is a damper dough which I've made using self-raising flour. I've used our local honey, wattle seed and dark ale. And the reason I use beer is because there's yeast in it and it makes the dough a bit lighter and fluffier. So basically what you do when you're making a damper is you put the flour into a bowl, you put the, the liquid into there and then you just gently bring it together. Now the most important thing is when you're making the dough, it's a bit like making scones, you don't overwork the dough. So we just need a little bit of flour to bring that together so it doesn't stick. We'll just work it slightly. So we just cut it. Now what we do with these pieces here is we look for the flat side like that and we just tuck it under. And then we just push it down with the palm of our hand and we slowly bring our fingers in. And there we go. All right, we're just gonna pop this in the oven now. It's on steam bake on a setting of 180 degrees. And this damper will take 20 20 minutes. Between food and music, you know, music is a, a thinking, listening thing, you know. Uh, food allows us, you know, to have a good yarn and hear stories, you know, you know, about each other and then to get to know each other, I suppose. You know, and you're sharing something of your, your, your personal self, you know, and then and that, that helps me connect myself to you, you know, and then you'll hear your story in whatever I'm singing about, you know, uh, share a moment of healing together. Damp is definitely a staple food and um, it's definitely been around for thousands of years in Aboriginal culture. Uh, it's been made by many things, different seeds, grasses, stuff like that. For this sort of a settings, we can serve it with things like soup or maybe we can do a nice emu liver pate or something like that. It'd be awesome. Try some bread. Thank you. It's a song I wrote in a moment of sorry business. Um, away from country and I was up in Queensland and uh, I got, got the message that my father's younger sister, husband, just passed away. And uh, his name was Sid Jones and he was like a father to me. And um, I wrote this song to help me heal. It's called Anna Louisa. <laughs> Eight children, a 
Sid Jones and Annie Louisa. Annie Louisa met her husband to be. She first set her eyes on Sid, driving her nose mobile. They fell in love there on Gunditch Mara lands. Then they got married and their life just began. Sid Jones and Annie Louisa. Sid Jones. Sid Jones and Annie Louisa Sid Jones and Annie Louisa Annie Louisa Gave birth to ten children Sid was a father from the old tin boxer, Sid worked on the railroad, laying down those sleepers. They shed their lives for 51 years. Sid Jones and Annie Louisa. Sid Jones and Annie Louisa. Annie Louise.